everyone, it's seven. So here are the accounts that I've been using to track ROI on different things. Mainly I'm doing it in USDT now. I used to do it in Ethereum, Ethereum Classic, Bitcoin, of course all the other little things that come across after Ethereum left like Ergo, uh, Dynex. I got a couple of bags of that stuff. So, but anyway, USDT is the way I'm tracking my returns. Basically, I have now six accounts. Uh, everything from the 16Q, 16P, KS0s, which are worthless, AL0s, which are not here yet. All the uh, stuff that I've done throughout the years, I just kind of keep a, a tab of. It's already paid for itself, but, you know, I like to reinforce it. Actually, when, uh, let me see if I can bring this up here. When I actually started this, tracking my ROI stuff, I started it to uh, ECT. Everything I was mining was converting into ECT. And that I would convert into uh, Ethereum, I believe. There we go. Yep. And now I'm just doing this. So using a mineable, getting USDT, putting it in these six accounts, I am tracking how I do my ROI. Once the ROI is complete, whatever is on that uh, particular account can roll over to another account to help. Everybody works on the accounts. You know what I'm saying? Not just the Qs. But the Q's and the P's are working on the Q account because that's the closest one I can get to finishing of the two first. Again, gas, uh, that, this one right here is uh, a write-off. I, I think it's going to be a write-off. Right now, I'm making 20 cents throwing 800 uh, giga hash. I'm making 20 cents a day after electricity. And that's with PB Farmer. So it's not looking good. AL zeros, man, I am excited about them, but I'm so scared about them because I'm afraid they're going to do the same thing Casper did to us. Nevertheless, I committed, so it's out there. The GPUs, that's everything that I've done over the last seven, eight years. Uh, and all that is going to be repaid back into Mother's account, so Mother can retire. Uh, well, not when it's done, but hopefully to ease Mother's pain. And then, of course, I have this one right here, which is open. We'll see if the X44 has ever come about right. That's a little bit about how I'm tracking my ROI. Everybody have a blessed day.